Hey guys, what's up? Hope you did great. Nikash Abdul back with another excited video tutorial. So, in this video, I will show you how you can fix a Sanna 4D Pro renderer OpenCL problem. So, I got many requests uh, who told me how to fix it. Uh, this error or oh, no OpenCL runtime library. So, there is a two one method uh, which really helped me out. I before one or two months I get this error, but I can fix it by installing this OpenCL driver. I'm using uh, Intel Core i7, so it's helped me. This driver helped me if you are using AMD, so you can go there. Uh, I mentioned link under description, so you find there easily. So just you can download it from there. Sorry, AMD Catalyst software for Windows. So I install this driver then my uh, what we say then my OpenCL Pro renderer working so NVIDIA developer if you use NVIDIA graphic card so also upgrade uh, your graphic card driver from the official website and also download just upgrade the driver so just download the OpenCL driver from Intel if you are using Intel or, or AMD you can download from there so I don't think so if you are using AMD you get this error so okay so here we go just scroll down you find here Intel SDK for OpenCL application I'm using Windows so just click there and scroll down here is all packages so I install first one I download it and install it then my pro render is working well so i hope it will help you so if it's not just comment below i will uh, and tell me your problem i try to fix your problem don't worry but let's try pro render what we can do with pro render it's really amazing uh rendering software in real time in viewport so okay we can start it so now it's only work with a uh, polygon mesh it's not, it's not work with floor or physical sky or background so you need to just do it manually so we create a plane for as a floor and okay so it's we create sphere let's try something and it worked uh, it's work with same material default cinema 4d material you don't need to add different you don't need to add uh, advanced type of material just is working with default material don't worry so I need to just increase and create a one box here and click here and fillet active filler so fillet working well with reflection so that's why i just give it filler look like that and it's same work with light but it's got too much lighty here okay like that but with light it's not look great so I love it without lighting because it's give you a really nice look so if you add light it's looking look little fake so but we can fix there just decrease the light here and change a little bit to a skylight and in shadows so can't control shadows from inside this light so let me find if there is any tag for pro renderer no there is nothing so let's go in settings so if we have if we see there there is a pro render setting so go down what we got there filter radio depth of field ray filter in a level of detail 100% okay we i don't see any shadow setting so it's okay i don't care about that too much so because 
let create material i have this cherry material and this chrome material now change that chrome material we use yeah that gives you a great looking glowing up texture it's give you a great looking glowing texture so that's looking great so it's look even better without light i it's my thought so let's give it a okay now that's looking great so uh, you can apply sky there so if you can apply sky so just create a texture for our sky so then we connect our sky with hdr link just add a sky apply hdr link tag drag and drop this texture here and launch your browser when you click on any texture there it takes little time so it's really a fun plugin so i hope you like this video if you don't solve your problem i'm always here for your help so if you don't subscribe my channel subscribe it and 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 what nothing thanks for watching